Hey, it's your boy Bobby Beast here. I want to talk about a subject that comes to mind, and that is Tariq's next moves. Now, when it comes down to it, Tariq right now is doing pretty good in Power Book uh, 2, Season 3 of Ghost. So, when it comes down to it, he's good. And what I mean by that is that when he came into Season 1, he was coming off of the death of his father and all that other stuff going on. And then we came into Season 2, he was coming off the death of Jabari and all that stuff going on. So, right now, he really doesn't have anything that's around him. There's really nothing that's coming at him like that right now. But when it comes down to it, we're going to talk about you know some stuff that i pretty much think is going on with him now what is the stuff that's um, going on with Tariq? basically right now with zeke dying you already know he's going to be looking at zeke's death like why did this even happen right not only that he's going to also you know monet's going to reach out to him to get the help because monet knows that he's the only one that she can trust like if any of anybody buddy was behind it she know Tariq could be the one who can find out who was behind that mess so not only that you also got to look at the fact that, and, and I bring this up a lot, he could be affected by Zeke's death because he was there because he was there to tutor Zeke. That was the reason why he was in school. And there's something else that I look at as well, um, and that is uh, Lauren. Lauren's going to play a big part with Tariq as well. And what I mean by that, if you guys can pretty much um, remember, um, it was Brayden who took her and he tricked her. And then it was Effie who took her. And remember, Effie teamed up with Kane. So whatever it was, it was between Brayden, Effie, and Kane about the death of Lauren. So when it comes down to it, Tariq got a lot going on there. And you already know there's some stuff that's going to, you know, go like... Basically, when it comes down to it, of course, Monet's going to reach out to him, though Tariq's probably not going to want nothing to do with the life anymore. But when it comes to Zeke, he'll probably try to find out what's going on in regards to Zeke. Um, the, the Zeke situation could be a situation or it could be a thing where he's going to stay in school because of his high you know, grades and things of that nature. And then the whole Lauren situation is really what I think is going to be the big one there. I think that the whole Lauren thing is really going to going to be really really big with Tariq in this season and if he finds out Brayden and Effie was behind it and that not and not only that but that Effie teamed up with Kane to do it this will make things worse and this is what um, creates people to be entirely cold that to the point they can't trust nobody because remember Brayden is the best friend and remember Effie is the one he loves and trusts now so with that being said if he finds out about this or he's pretty much going to find out about it but when he finds out about this you're going to be seeing a different Tariq now when it comes down to it um those are the main things i see going on with him and also his mom he knows where he knows where his mom is at now and what i mean by that is that okay with him knowing that you don't think that he's actually not going to try and reach out to his mother you don't think that he's not going to actually try to come across her i think that he definitely will try to reach out to her i think that season three is going to bring about um a lot of changes and the main thing that i'm really looking forward to seeing when it comes to Tariq is mainly growth i think that he's been working with the tahadas you know he's been with them in season one he's been with them in season two and they really showed him who they are and in my opinion i think the tahadas was his karma for all the stuff that he did in book one because look he went through it in season one and in season two he went through it and i'm pretty sure he got some more stuff that he's got to go through in season three but i think he should definitely cut ties with the tahadas he really shouldn't be messing with them like that I think that he should be really just become his own man now. The thing is, is that with him, he's so used to working with people and you got to work with somebody. Even if you are um, the boss, you gotta, you're got you working with someone. But at the end of the day, I don't think that being around the Tejadas really help Tariq. I think that he needs to, he it wouldn't help him. He needs to go off and he needs to do his own thing. He needs to connect with someone else. And I want to say, if I want to see it, I'd love to see him connect with Tommy because Tommy got the product as well, known as Dahlia, right? So when it comes down to it, I think what we need to see is him become his own person, him do his own thing. And that's something I definitely want to see when it comes to Tariq. But those are pretty much the things that I think is going to be going on with Tariq and Power on Book 2, Season 3. But we'll have to sit back and we'll see. I just want to say to all of you that is your boy, Bobby B's here. I just want to say much love, much respect. Hold it down. And one. Hey, it's your boy, Bob.